I speak over your life in the name of Jesus. You are and remain a sign and a wonder. You are and remain a sign and a wonder. May my God keep lifting you. May my God keep blessing you. May my God keep empowering you. There will not be a better yesterday for you. You keep going from glory to glory, from grace to grace. In the name of Jesus. Every area of challenge in your life, I declare this week, may you experience the hand of God there. Experience the favor of God. Someone is getting to know Jesus through you. Someone is getting transformed through your witness. Someone is getting healed through your life. Someone is rising above curses and yokes through your life. Go and represent Jesus in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I want you to hold hands with someone by your left and right if you can. We're going to pray two serious prayers in this place. The first prayer is you are going to cry for a fresh baptism of the spirit of revelation. Paul said that I may know him. He knew many things, but his focus was him. Not that I may know it. There were many it's he knew. He, it was Paul that brought order to the program of God. Order to how many things be done. But he said that I may know him. Let that be your prayer. By the spirit of revelation, Lord help me to know you. Help me to understand Jesus. Help me to understand your prophetic program as far as the gospel and salvation is concerned. Someone is praying. Praying with seriousness. Praying with sincerity from the depth of your heart. If you are a man of God, pray. Your members are at the mercy of your understanding. Pray. No matter how much you have deviated, there is still room to square up your understanding for the sake of those you lead and for the sake of your own growth. Go ahead and pray. The spirit of revelation comes to our lives connecting us to God's eternal plan helping us to understand the gospel to understand salvation and to understand the program of God the spirit of revelation drawing out lessons cautions drawing out principles from scripture that help the believer to walk in total victory the spirit of revelation inspiring the spirits and the minds of believers giving us the ability to birth thoughts to birth ideas that empower us to be productive that empower us to sponsor advancement at a personal level at a societal level at a territorial level the spirit of revelation activating the prophetic dimension that is inherent in every believer helping us to take advantage of the prophetic resources we have at our disposal to live excelling Christian lives dreams, visions revelations the prophetic I choose the way of the Lord I want to establish the second prayer point I choose the way of the Lord for the way of the Lord is the way of wisdom. I choose the way of the Lord. For the way of the Lord is the way of wisdom. I choose the way of the Lord. One more time, sing it from your heart. For the way of the Lord is the way. Of wisdom, I choose the way of the Lord. Hallelujah. The second prayer point, listen please. The second prayer point is a burden in my heart that I'm sharing with you. We are going to pray for the body of Christ. Lord, let the spirituality in the body of Christ translate to profit and value that exalts Jesus and frontiers the cause of the kingdom. We are tired of fanatism. We are tired of extremism. Are we together? We are tired of the interruptions that our human nature is bringing to the program of God. You are going to pray and say, Lord, breathe upon us. We are available vessels. Let our praying in tongues, let our fastings, let our Bible studies, let our consecrations translate to value that our world can see. Christians and non-Christians,
governments, leaders, heads of state, captains of industry, that they can see the profit point of serving God through our lives. Go ahead and pray. Go ahead and pray. Pray for the body of Christ. Pray for the body of Christ. We are the light of the world. A city that is set on a hill that cannot be hidden. Neither do men light a lamp and put it under a bushel, but it is put on a lampstand, a candlestick, and it gives light to all who are there. Take a minute and pray. We pray for the body of Christ in Nigeria. We pray for the body of Christ in Africa. We pray for the body of Christ in Europe. The body of Christ in America. The body of Christ in Asia. In the name of Jesus, let us come as a corporate people into a season where the love, the values, the character, the power, the wisdom, the profitability that comes from being a Christian, the profitability, the value that comes by being a person of faith, let it be translated to nation building. Let it be translated to territorial transformation. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. Glory be to the name of the Lord in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord Jesus. Father, we thank you. Go ahead and begin to bless him. Bro, this kili balato shabra kaladaba. Marada balagada brandi shibra dosko pekele de bata. Zilaba roske palata di to sata. Father, we thank you. Blessing for all the benefits you have enjoyed within the week. He said, I sleep and I wake up. Not just because I desire to wake up. He said, because you sustained me. So for every time you sleep and you wake up, it's by the sustaining mercy and the power of God. Would you go ahead and just give him praise? He said, I will bless the Lord, O oh my soul. And I will forget not all his benefits. Begin to count of his benefits and of his goodness that you have enjoyed within the week. One of blessing for the house of Koinonia. For impact and great and mighty things is doing all across the nations of the earth. Even from this fountain, go ahead and give him praise. One of blessing for the life of God's servants. He said, I will give you a pastor. Can we bless the name of the Lord for the shepherd whom he has given to us? Even at such a time like this. Unto the edification of the body. Oh, bara deske lebrin deske palagata. Shala baraske te brin deske te porida. Embrata raskata balada resika. Sheti pato bread deke pe ladaba. Ambranda karada brado kono bedeba. Eris kalato shibrakata. Embreke te pilabata. Ashilate. Eris kapate breke te kita. I'd like you to begin to present yourself before His Majesty and say, Father, tonight I have come. Shalabarate, abrakata balakete brekete kebeleke deba. Shalabarasko brekete pa, embakata pratika. Shalabate, embronto sikapa. Shalabrande kete parusa, embranda kebeleke pa. He said, When I cry. Then shall the enemy turn their back from me. This I know, for thou art for me. When I cry, the same said, Shabakata brekete kepa, embate kepetika, aparate shelekete pa, embrakata, embrakata, shabato pekete pa. That means if you don't cry, every situation remains, every enemy remains. He said, but when, when talks about time, this is the time for you to lift up a cry to the heaven. I said tonight, Ashiata, Empeke Tekipata, Empratopa, Shalamba Riske Tekepe, Empreteke Petada. When I cry, then shall the enemy turn their back from me. 
When I cry, then shall the situation vanish. When I cry, then shall the affliction roll away. When I cry, then shall the enemy turn their back from me. This I know. This I know. This I know. This I know. This is the confidence that we have. That when he asks, according to his will, according to his will, he heareth us. Somebody's praying. Somebody's crying. Somebody's presenting himself to the Lord. Shabakata. And break it to keep up. And break it to keep up. Shabalakate beretista. Abiga. Emo pekete brekete. And break it to pekete. Abia. And proto. When beti. And topia. About to keep tekete. Somebody's praying. Present your cause. Present your cause. Present your case. Father. Lord. Here I am, standing in the midst of prayer, standing in the congregation of the tabernacle. Shabakata kepekete kepa, abranda kepa. The Bible said when there was two in the office of priesthood and minister, the Bible said the plague stayed in Israel. The plague stayed when there was two. Can you stand in the office of a priest? I begin to administer prayer that every plague we find is tonight. Shapakata kapalakata. He said, My house, my house, my house shall be called the house of prayer, not the den of thieves. I like you to begin to rebuke every activities of thieves in your life. Shapakata Shabalakata balakata prekele de balababa. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Blessed is he who comes in the name of our God. Holy are you who comes. Sabalakata prekete lekete brando ko pekata Sibalata a brando ko pekete prekete Sibalata brando ske pekete pa Shala brando ske te predika Am brando ske te prekete kupa I branda kabata I shabala A ros ke te keta I la brando ske te predia Zubalate 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 in pronto te peke te kepa Shabala kata brade keta Shilabare ske peke te kepa I brando sko peke te pa Shibra kata ba Le rus kata te te pa Lord I am your house Lord I am your temple Every spirit buying and selling Abate ke te kre te pa Shalate E rus abake te kre te pa we terminate your activities tonight. We terminate your activities tonight. Under this anointing, Eru Shabati, Abate go pente kepe, Esu salato para, Shalaparas de tepo, Emprento kopuli, Zaliate, 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 Shilabarata kapa. Shebeke te prente ke bata, shibala da barre se preke le ba, shabala kata preke le de bala da ba, zupata pa, em pronto, shibala te, em pronto kopa, shalato pento, ilate ke produce kapata. Let's thank him for his goodness. Let's thank him for his mercy. Come and go ahead, lift up your voice. Make sure the heavens can hear your voice. Bless him from the depth of your heart. The Bible says, if the Lord had not been on our side, now may we say, lift up your voice, lift up your hands and just reverence the name of the Lord. Inside and outside, you came here desperate. You came here hungry. You came here hungry for transformation. 
hungry for a change of destiny just lift up your voice and make known your expectation tonight bless him from the depth of your heart bless him in your understanding bless him in the spirit this is the moment where you have an opportunity to just make known your expectation before the God of all flesh, the Father of all spirit. Lift up your voice and bless him. Lift up your voice and bless him inside and outside. Don't be left out. Bless him from the depth of your spirit. Father, we honor you. We reverence you. We come before your throne. The throne of your majesty. The throne of your goodness. The throne of your mercy. The throne of your grace. Bless him in the spirit. Bless him in your understanding. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. Blessed be the name of the Lord. For in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Pray in the Holy Ghost. Build up capacity. Charge up your inner man. Be strengthened by your inner man. And shake away unbelief. Let faith rise to make you to step out. For the Bible says without faith it is impossible to please God. Have faith come by hearing. But you build up your faith in praying in the Holy Ghost. By generating energy in the spirit. And shaking away every lukewarmness. I challenge you that you can pray that habit away. I don't know what that habit you are struggling. Is it smoking? Is it drinking? Is it immorality? You can pray it away. You can go to God and contend for the spirit of holiness. I say, Lord, take this thing away from me, O oh God. This is a house of an encounter. This is a house of prayer. My prayer life should not go down. This is a house of revelation. Why do I open the Bible and I cannot understand? The Bible speaking in the book of Titus, it says, For the grace that bringeth salvation has appeared unto men. There is a grace that can bring that in which you are trusting God for. Teaching us that grace can teach you on what to do. He said, There is a spirit in man for the breath of the Almighty. Give you that man understanding. For you have unshown for the Holy One teaching you. You are a businessman, don't keep quiet. It doesn't matter whether you are. I said, Lord, give me an idea. I don't know what you did to Jacob in the dream. How can a man wake up and all of a sudden he bailed himself from slavery or Laban? Lord, what did you do to Solomon? That Solomon wake up, just offered a thousand pound offering. Go to bed and wake up and something happened to him. Lord, do that to me, oh God. I don't know what you have done to your servant. I don't know the baptism of your love that you have put upon him. Lord, put it upon me tonight, oh God. Pray in the Holy Ghost. The Bible is speaking, he said, the day Jesus was baptized, he was not the only one. Others were being baptized and pick up their clothes, they left. The Bible said, Jesus came out of the water, he was praying. He knew that my destiny has to open. The Bible said, why he was praying? The heavens were open and the Father spoke. He said, this is my beloved son. You have been coming here January, February. You can choose to keep quiet. Lord, you gave your servant that prophetic word. That is a year of a sitting great reward. It's not a year of reward. There has to be a sitting. Uncommon result has to happen to me. Pray. Cantela palata. Mary say, how shall this thing be? Seeing that I know not a man. He said, the Holy Ghost shall come upon you. Can you contend for that dimension that the Holy Ghost will come upon you? Even the fruitful field shall become a forest. Please pray. 
Tanta keto wapata lata. Akia kakaka koro wapate. Tata kata kakakuka. Akia kakaka karuaka. Taka kaka kiko kokara katia tuata. Cha chop your inam. Cha jito. Cha jo inam. Jesus. For unto you the answer prayer shall all flesh come. I don't need to tell people that I am a son of an apostle. Let my results speak, oh God. Let my heaven be open. You had the testimony of our brother. There are some of us who are still trusting God. That God will reconcile your family. Don't keep quiet tonight. It's risky to keep quiet under this atmosphere. You just have a few more minutes. I don't know the position you like to take. But if you can hold on to the house of heaven, I say, Lord, let your glory, let my glory manifest, oh God. This is an a house of encounter. The Bible is speaking about John, Peter and John. The Bible says in the hours of prayer, they were entering the temple. They met a man begging. Peter said, look at us. He said, look on us. The man gave them eye expecting something. But Peter said, I don't know about John. But silver and gold I have known. But what I have, I will give unto you. For as many that have received him, he gave them power to become. Do you have that power? Power to prosper. Power to excel. Power to break forth. Power for all the Lord, I am tired of being an ordinary Christian. No power, no grace. Put something upon me, oh God. There is a place my heart cries for, for deep collect authority. Something is calling us tonight. It's not an ordinary meeting as usual. Something is being stirred up in the spirit. If you can dive in tonight, Something will happen to us. It's not an unusual, an ordinary meeting. It's a, a man Zion of encounter. Katalaba. Pray, 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 pray. I charge you a few minutes to pray. Even from the days of John the Baptist, the kingdom of God suffered left violent. Only the violent that get it by force. You have been too gentle. You have been too gentle. That's why doors are not open. Put pressure on heaven. He said, give him no rest. Give him no rest until he establishes Jerusalem. Are you giving God quality thanks for tonight? For your manifold blessings? For your good hand upon our lives? You have done all things well and to you be all the glory. Someone is telling God thank you. Thank you for your word. Thank you for your spirit. They go from strength to strength. Everyone that appears before the Lord in Zion. Hallelujah. Now cry your heart before the Lord and say, give me an encounter tonight. Give me a destiny defining visitation. Someone is praying. A destiny defining visitation a destiny defining visitation let me hear something that will change my life forever let me encounter a dimension of the spirit that will cause me to flourish even in the spirit for in jesus mighty name we pray in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Thank you for watching that amazing video. 
by a man of God, Apostle Joshua Silman. I believe that you are blessed. And please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. See you in our next video. I love